all right guys welcome to noisegate media today i'll be teaching you how to set up your count of in Protus, especially if you must have a very successful recording now one way to do this is to ensure that in your Pro Tools that you find your transport bar showing right here and then of course do not forget that the f12 is a very unique number and a very good shortcut in Pro Tools. with your f12 you can actually start your recording but before then your track must be armed to do this your transport bar in this very window is not showing right go to your window click on transport bar and then you have your transport bar here so you have to make sure this is enabled and then you look for the track you want to record your audio run and ensure that it is also armed this, this way when, when you, you press, press your f12 your track will automatically start to record but what we are treating today is that uh, when if you must record probably you want to play an instrument you have an artist who is going to be singing there needs to be a number of counts before the actual recording starts so what you should do is to ensure that this count of is highlighted if not you are never going to have a number of counts before the actual recording starts so to do this ensure this is highlighted now I just turn it off now you can also decide the number of bars you want before the actual recording starts. it could be one bar it could be two it could be three four depending on how much rest and number of counts you want before the actual recording starts to set this one bar or more just go to your setup click on click count of you're going to realize you have count of only during record this you have to check this please okay I just I just checked it but now we have one bar here for example I need two bars before my artist starts to sing I have put two here and then click OK so it reflects here two bars then you put here also you count of is enabled come here I'm your track okay, okay. F12. F12 two three four one two three four then, then you record it starts immediately after the two bars that I have assigned here thank you for being part of this I do hope you have learned one or two things and I do hope this video was very explicit if you have questions please do feel free to ask me pertaining to this very topic or any other topic of, of choice and I will be so glad to share with you my knowledge in my next video I'll be teaching you and treating the topic how to set up click track in Pro Tools because without a click track you definitely will not be able to hear your metronome count while you're recording thank you once again